I wanted to share this with the ladies. Reason being is because I think it could help somebody, it could motivate somebody, it could inspire somebody. And no, this is not true across the board for everybody. I'm no medical expertise or any of that, no doctor or anything like that. I just wanted to share an experience that happened with me. So in 2020, you know, when the whole outbreak of COVID happened, right? And I remember I got really, really sick and I went to the hospital and the hospital was packed and they told me that I had bronchitis, right? And then later on the whole COVID thing came out, the whole shutdown happened. Some time was going by, some weeks and stuff. And I think I had COVID, y'all. I know they told me I had bronchitis, but I really think I had COVID because when they start talking about all the signs, I was like, oh my goodness, that sound more like COVID than anything. But something started happening after that whole thing. Normally, I wear my hair short. I always have worn my hair short for the most part. I wear braids here and there, but for the most part, I wore uh, my hair short. And I just love wearing my hair short. But anyway, my hair started coming out a lot, like shedding. And I, you know, when you keep your hair short, it's just like, you really don't notice it, but I started noticing because a lot of it was coming out. And I was like, oh my goodness. And you know, the first thing you think about is something like real bad and drastic. So I was like, oh God, I don't want to go to the doctor. What could this be? It continued on. It continued. And it started to like slack up a little bit. And I ended up going to the doctor. So... When I finally went to the doctor, I got some information. Oh my goodness, if something is going on with you, go to the doctor. We need to stop it with the nonsense. And if something is going on, that's what they're there for. But anyway, <laughs> so they told me that I was in perimenopause. I'm like, okay. I hadn't been experiencing any hot flashes or any any mood swings or anything like that. But what comes with that is like hair loss and fatigue and tiredness and all of that, right? So COVID, hair loss, perimenopause. I'm like, give me a break. <laughs> so yeah. So working with the with the doctors and you know, getting things all handled and figured out. So yeah, this is my baby, y'all. This is this, I, this is Amber, y'all. This is Amber. But anyway, um, it slacked up, you know, with the hair shedding. But I just wanted to share that because other women may be going through perimenopause, the things that we as women go through. Oh my goodness, do the guys going through anything? Oh my goodness, jeez. But yeah, so I just wanted to share that there are some days, y'all, I'm still zapped. No energy, just tired as all get out. And on top of that, I have alpha thalassemia, which is a blood, um, di a blood disorder. So that makes me wiped out too. But anyway, I'm going to the doctor and we're getting all these things figured out. But I just wanted to just share that to encourage and motivate somebody or someone. I hope that by me sharing my story will motivate you or encourage you if you're going through something similar or have. And if you're feeling down about it or if you're trying to decide to go to the doctor to find out what's going on, I hope this helped you.